Please note in this video, we are using a single suture seal packet that contains enough polymer for a 15 centimeter long suture or equivalent square wound area. Also, remember that refrigeration of suture seal is recommended if the product that you have received is not used within five days of receipt. Remove suture seal from refrigeration 10 minutes before mixing the contents for ideal product application. It is recommended that suture seal be applied at room temperature. These are the directions on how to properly mix and apply suture seal. There are three basic steps. One, prepare. Two, mix. Three, apply. The first step is to prepare the components. Open the foil pouch and remove the three components, two syringes and a tube case containing the application brush. One syringe is a 2.5 milliliter syringe containing 50 milligrams solid white powder hydrogel polymer, and the other is a three milliliter syringe containing liquid phosphate buffer solution. Remove the sterile application brush from the brush case and have it ready for use. Remove the caps from the two syringes and connect them together. Now you are ready for the second step, mixing the contents of the syringes. You will mix the contents of the two syringes by vigorously pushing the plungers back and forth for 30 strokes, which is approximately 10 to 15 seconds. Consider using a timer, as it is easy to lose track of time, which will cause the product to become too viscous to apply. The formation of tiny bubbles in the mixture is normal. Once mixed, push all the liquid into the larger male syringe. Disconnect the two syringes and attach the sterile application brush tip. The last step is to apply suture seal to the affected area. Suture seal can be applied to incisions with sutures or staples and many types of open wounds. It is important to note that after the products are mixed, you have approximately 80 to 120 seconds to apply suture seal to the incision or wound before it gels into a clear, flexible sealant. Slowly push the syringe plunger until the suture seal polymer begins to dispense from the brush tip. Brush the suture seal polymer over the suture line or wound area in a thin, even layer. Suture seal is sometimes difficult to see because it is transparent or a milky white color. Runoff of excess liquid is expected. Within two minutes, the suture seal polymer will become an adherent gel. Suture seal will remain on the suture or wound area for approximately 14 days and will biodegrade away slowly. Apply a second application of suture seal if the suture or wound is not completely healed after 14 days. Suture seal is recommended for any open wounds, cuts, scrapes, abrasions, burns, lit granulomas, hot spots, and all surgical incisions including spay and neuter, mass removals, pop head injuries, amputations, abscesses, and orthopedic procedures. Suture seal is safe to use on all non-food animal species including canine, feline, equine, reptile, exotic animals, birds, and sea mammals. 